Uh, welcome back to Let's Play Golden Stone with me, Swift. Can we do something to help? Uh, not like now we can't, but we will try later. Oh, well, it's about time you started agreeing with me, Swift. Yeah, I must say, it's pretty rare I agree with you. Why the hell did I agree with you, anyway? I don't mind. <laughs> what are you two talking about? Gareth thinks we can help. It's too dangerous. If you fail, your lives will be in danger, too. Besides, don't you have your own quest to pursue? Uh. Ah, uh, fine, I guess. Thought so. I knew there had to be a reason Ivan had stayed with you, instead of returning home directly from Vault. What will happen to Lord Hammond? Hammond is a good hostage for them. They will not kill him. We shall wait for another message from Lumper. Lady Lena, I cannot leave like this. It will be fine, Ivan. Hammond would not want to distract you from. I apologize, I said, I've said more than I should. Sounds like Hammett knows more about our mission, doesn't he? Doesn't it? <laughs> I suppose I can keep it a secret no longer. Very well, I shall tell you. He swore an oath to a Jupiter adept. A Jupiter adept? Have you heard of a village called Vale? Hmm, have I? Of course I bloody well have. You are from Vale? Really, then the prophecy was true. What prophecy? Three years ago, after the terrible storm that struck only Mount Earth, Ivan must depart on a journey with warriors from Vale. So was foretold. Yes, yeah, sir, we don't need you, Mir. I've heard nothing of any such prophecy. Hear that, Mir? Warriors from Vale, we don't need an Emil healer. It happened several years before Hammett founded Kai. He was off travelling. Hammett felt he had reached an impasse as a merchant then. He risked his life on a journey to find a new source of business. He was in mortal danger at the southwestern edge of the world, when some adepts appeared and saved his life. He had lost consciousness. When he awoke, he found himself in their village. Just a moment, am I from that village? Yes, the adept gave him the shaman's rod and you, along with some doubloons. Doubloons? Were they golden doubloons? Yes, let's see, you are called... I'm Mia, Lady Lena. There was a lot of gold from Mia, but he has also received some business advice. Business advice? Hammett, the greatest merchant ever known? Yes, guy, Hammett had, has the adepts to thank for his success. Wow, I never heard anything like that. He was advised to buy silk in Zion and sell it in Tolby. To see anything sell so well, it's like a dream come true. There's no denying that that was when Hammett picked up his knack for business. Did he have to promise them anything in return? Ah yes, Ivan. It is something you will need on your journey. Something we need on our journey? The adept asked Hammett to use the shaman's rub to obtain it. He looked for this object wherever he went, but he could never find it. Then three years ago, a storm struck, one that hit only Mount Aeoth. How it was worried that time was running out, but he had managed to unearth a clue just in time. That Ivan is why he took you with the caravan on this last journey north. I had no idea, so that must be why he left the rod in my care. But then... No Ivan, you mustn't blame yourself. It was my carelessness that caused the rod to be stolen, and ultimately, that's why Lord Hammer is being held in Lumpad. You must continue your journey and complete your quest. You can't blame yourself. But what will happen to Hammett? I will handle this. And don't forget the soldiers of Kelly! Continue on your journey and do not worry about Hammett. I'm so sorry I cannot tell you more about the Shaman's Word. No, don't apologize. The Shaman's Word will help us find the thing we need for our quest, right? We you look for it? Uh, yeah. Don't we already have it? Seth so says we will, then there's nothing to worry about. Oh well, take care of yourselves. Was it the thing that the rods for we're supposed to find? <laughs> Return to your post, everyone. Hmm, so Hammett's in trouble. Sounds like a sub-quest. Which it is, but we can't do it yet. Eh. Not nothing there. Now let's raid the castle. Why did I use that? 
I'm sure there's something in there. Ah, here we go. A nut! sell stuff but I don't think they sell them yet. Uh, yay the water jacket. <coughs> right, water jacket. Obviously it's gonna quit. I'm gonna optimize Isaac a bit more. Hmm. I'll maybe we can get some else. Basically, it raises your resistance to water and fire. I should really clean my inventory out. So. Oh, uh, sometimes if you go to certain covers, slip into the wardrobe. There's a turban. It's a symbol of Kelly soldiers. Some of them have some weird stuff. I think I think it's on book two. There's actually a wardrobe. <laughs> Ah! Let's pretend we didn't see that. <laughs> I like that one. I think it's on book two. Hmm? So, sorry, I thought I was just... You know, thought I saw something. Never mind. Well, it's like we're done in here for now. Hmm. I'm sure I remember something else. Did I get that? No, no I didn't. I remember there's some dialogue in here. Can't remember how you get it. You've got to talk to someone or some people. I think it's in the inn. Guess seem to be here in Toby. How it will pop in Toby and his closet. Preventive and build the younger. Blah blah blah. All strong men. Blah blah blah. How you getting closer? You guys warriors. All warriors dream of colossus. Some blah blah blah. I can't remember who we're supposed to talk to. I know we're supposed to talk to some people. <laughs> yeah, I'm not bothering to read all this. I just want to. Yeah, all these people going to Toby. I think we've got to speak to someone in particular. I can't remember who. Might be those two. Here we go. Okay, all this thing. Let's stop way right here. I can't remember who we're supposed to talk to. I think I might have actually already got it. I think you've only got to talk to the two guides. I think. I can't remember. Why are we stopping at a place like this? Yeah, we have to hurry. We'll be late for Colosso. Live Colosso? We can't have that. I won't do it all. We paid good money to see Colosso. We can't be late. Everything will be just fine, folks. You just check and make sure no one's missing. Well, I guess that's okay. But if anyone's missing, we're the ones who'll miss out. Forget about them, let's just get a move on. Oh dear. Alright, hurry up and start counting. We shot one person, now where could he be? What's going on? Why aren't we leaving for Toby yet? There are a lot of people waiting to see Carso here. Hey, what's up? Why are the guides pacing back and forth? Come on, why aren't we leaving yet? I hear there's a landslide on the road to Toby. We pay good money to set this cruise to see Colossal. Let's decide if we're going to be Colossal once we reach Toby. Why when we're leaving they tell us we have to ride a boat? I can't stand boats so if I'd known I never would have come. It's just a shame a man like you can't ride on a boat, you and us. 
Oh, I know. I'm <laughs> okay, I think I might have pronounced his name wrong. <laughs> no, who cares? Let's hope we can't wait any longer. Can't wait? What do you mean? We all knew that anyone who was late would be left behind, right? Everyone understood that. Then what's the problem? We'll miss the boat if we wait any longer. Miss the boat? We can't let that happen. We're paying a lot of money. We have to arrive before the carnival starts. There's nothing we can do. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Okay, follow me and stay in line. And away they go. Now where did my toy group get to? They, they wouldn't left without me, would they? Oh no, I better get moving. And we better get moving to see you next...